Yeah, Mike, Chris did a walkthrough with the police. So is the concern a shooter? We get threats all right. the time. I'm, I'm not going to not do the rally. Come on, give me your name. Reverend Alfred Sharpton, chairman of the National Youth Movement. We just buried a boy, and the only thing he did wrong was he was born on the wrong side of the track. In New York City in the 80s, what we wanted to say, people did not want to hear. So you had to be loud because you were not invited to address the public. So they can't ride us fair. They don't need to ride. This is the beginning of a civil rights movement in New York. It's all the media's fault. These things should be kept quiet. Now shop and go home. They will say that we are exasperating racial tensions, but the people know the truth. George Floyd's story has been the story of black folks. There's a truth we talk about calling for a big march. We won't put two, 300,000 people in Washington. If the question comes from the media about looting, he wanted to pass to you to set the tone. Couldn't breathe. I understand the anger. I've been fighting these issues for decades. Anytime you start shaking the root of this system, then you're going to have a discredit campaign. No justice! No justice! Senator Schumer, we have not had the legislative response to the litany of cases of policing all the way from Rodney King to now. 2020, we must deal with police brutality. We've got to turn these stations upside down. All of our lives, you had to fight to make sure that you control the story. I want the folks at CBS to know if you can't tell the story right, don't tell it at all. You've got to be able to raise the theater level to where you don't lose control, but it is dramatic enough that you can't be ignored either.